Hey everyone, on Next Gen Tactics. My name is Hypermole, and you probably have gotten that already, considering I've got the big ass letters on the screen. And this is nuts. I feel so honoured to be able to put up a video on the actual main channel for Next Gen Tactics. I mean, when I won the a place on the directors list back in October, it was a big deal for me. I, I kind of nuts. Um. So, for you guys that don't really, didn't really follow the director's competition or anything like that, here is a little clip of where you probably do remember me from. So, can you believe I'm getting <laughs> trash talked by Hypermoil? Okay, I'm a dead man walking, Hyper? Alright, alright. I'm coming for you. Oh! Oh! Stuck! Oh! Hypermoil, you're dead! You're dead! You're dead, man! I'm a dead man walking? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, that was so fitting. Unbelievable. I That was... Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that was me back in August 2010. And Spider-Man posted that clip so many times, so I just wanted to give you guys a little history in the sense that, like, right, that's who he was. Oh, I remember that clip. Or the guys that haven't seen it, they get to laugh at me straight away and they're new to the channel, so you guys get to see where I came from and what kind of fun we had back in the day of Modern Warfare 2. And a lot of people seem to think that was uh, there was a bit of malice in that, but there was no malice, it was just general online play. As a lot of you people probably know, I can't, I'm playing with Spider-Man on a regular basis, so there's definitely no hardships there, and we, we all occasionally laugh about it. When I'm sending emails, I normally send a little bottom of the uh, the throwaway line at the bottom saying, like, your friend in Semtex, Hypermole. So, uh, to continue on with the history theme, I'm going to give you a kind of brief history of Hypermole. The, I'm 30 years old. A lot of people don't realise that I'm 30 years old. Some people think I'm a lot younger than I am, and I don't care about that. I mean, I act silly and I'm stupid online and that's the way I want to be, I'm just kind of crazy. <laughs> um, I say th such stupid things sometimes but that's the great thing about online with these headsets, you can just throw things out there, you're in a room yourself with a group of friends and you can say the stupidest things and we all just laugh about it. I mean just recently I've been getting a lot of funny comments because I was playing on the live stream the, the Kill Whore Challenge with spider Bite. And I just came off with a line of, I, I'm a stealth caterpillar. And people seem to be focused on that, and I, I, I don't know where it came from, but... Eh. I'm just glad you guys are enjoying this stuff. So the brief history of High Promo is, I've been playing games for a long time. Uh, I've played the Master System, the Mega Drive, the CPC 464 from Amstrad. I've played a Pong console, I had one in the house. Super Nintendo... Nintendo 64 for a long time. Uh, missed out on the GameCube. On the PlayStation 2. Which I actually won in a competition, which is kind of awesome. And then... Then it was the PlayStation 3. And now I currently own a Wii and an Xbox as well. So I've played everything. I've touched base on pretty much everything. And... I just hope... Uh, it gives me perspective. A lot of the newer gamers... I'm probably looking at games and thinking, oh, that's amazing. They probably don't see much of a change in graphical standards as much as I do. I mean, in their space of time, when they get to my age, they've probably seen a huge graphical change, but considering I've been playing since games, how many load for 20 minutes to get to playing the game, to games that you can play online with friends constantly, uh, it's just a kind of it's an amazing trip. Man, I'm just trying, I'm making myself out to be ancient. Not as old as guns or spiders, so that's good. The, and also I talk about the fact that I'm not just a one trip pony, I don't just play FPS games. I play a lot of single player games, and I love single player games. The story arc, I'm, I've been a huge movie and music fan for years. So stories in these kind of things, like movies, story is everything. I mean, if you've not got a good story, you're not going to get anywhere, and that's a simple fact. And 
the same with single player campaigns. I, I need a story to enthrall me. And just recently, Crisis 2 very, very disappointed. It was a huge disappointment to me, the storyline. I didn't enjoy it. I loved Crisis 1, and I was a PC gamer for a long time, and I never mentioned that in my history. I played a lot of PC games, and it's kind of disappointing me. I'm not going to go into it too much because that's not what this video is about. But I talk. I want to say that I don't just play FPS games. I play. I've got racing games. I've not picked up Gran Turismo, but I played Motor Storm, the Need for Speed games. I've got Split Second still. Uh, I play a lot of third-person stuff, which is like Uncharted games, the Grand Theft Auto series, and I play. I don't play as many sports games. I used to play FIFA, the soccer game, as you guys would call it, but FIFA football for me. And and used to play Tiger Woods a lot. I, I was addicted to Tiger Woods for a long time on PlayStation 2, and I liked Fight Night as well. And I want and play are some RPGs. I've been posting up the Demon Souls on Next Gen Tactics games, and I just want to, I want to pop up here. I'm I'm I must admit I'm slightly overwhelmed. This is about take seven or something like that. I'm trying to do this commentary, and every time I do it, my brain I start talking about Next Gen Tactics, the main channel, and then my brain starts thinking, yeah, you do realise this like over <laughs> like just. Crazy amount of people over there now. Considering I normally only talk to about a group of a uh, thousand people at the very thousand people here and there, it uh, kind of freaks me out to think about how many people are probably watching this. And uh, it's just I, I I get overwhelmed with that. And to be here, let alone on the next gen games channel. It's amazing to me. So, if you guys see like what you're seeing on the screen at the moment, and go check out my Demon Souls and Limbo playthroughs. Um, Demon Souls is the current one. Limbo is finished. No, oh, almost. I'll try to get the achievements now. Just to finish it up, do like a spider bite, give you a hundred percent gamer score, and go check them out. If you like what you've seen and heard. And I'm always kind of up to date. I like playing the newer games. And if you like a lot of single player things, walkthroughs and things like that, come and tell me what you'd like to see. I'm more than willing to try and get them up there. I have some plans for future game releases and older games to play. Because I made a promise back when I was doing the Next Gen Tactics Director's Competition to do a playthrough of But I'm going to keep that until a special time. And, yeah, I'm kind of lost for words again, and I just want to thank everybody that supported me in the competition, and thank everybody that's came over to my channel and followed me there, and watching my videos on the NGT Games channel, and thank Spiderbite Guns, and for <laughs> being there during the competition, and giving me the opportunity to post over here. Uh, it's I'm just amazed. Um, thank you, everybody. I, I'm, I've gotten to a kind of awestruck part, and I, I just want to end it here. So, again, thank you, everybody, and take care, and I'll see you guys online. Take care, everybody. Hey, guys, we now have our own website. Actually, we've always had our own website, but why not follow us on there? There you'll find all our videos conveniently sorted into playlists by game, as well as videos from many other directors that are part of our NGT network. 